Hi everybody, I have a new Star Wars related hair tutorial. This is the hairstyle that young Beru, you know, Luke's aunt, wore in Attack of the Clones. This is a very simple hairstyle. Probably the hardest part is figuring out the symmetry and, you know, the placements. I don't know about you, but I'm really bad with symmetry. And I had to redo this hairdo like 10 times over. Anyway, enough blabbing, let's get started. Alright, what you will need are bobby pins, a hair comb, hair bands, and hairspray. So start out by parting your hair into three different sections and do it from ear to ear. Make sure that the back part is a little bit thicker than the other two. And then you want to braid the two front sections. Start around the part line and do a somewhat tight braid. You don't really want your part line to show. And braid all the way down until you can no more. I grabbed a little bit of hair from the back because my bangs are still growing out and I need a little bit more thickness for the braids. I also used hairspray to hold my bangs and other little hairs into place. So a small story, about two weeks ago I was trying to do one of Padme's hairstyles but I kept failing and I was showing my brother the final results trying to figure out if I should edit the video or not. And he's like, hey that looks like that girl from the Attack of Clones hairdo. And that's how this video came about. I don't think anyone cared about the little story, but I needed to fill in some silence. Okay, I'm going to do a trick that will make the other side braid in like two seconds. Okay, are you ready? Ba bam Alright, I know you all like my little trick I did there. Okay, so now you got both sides braided, so you make those little flower things by twit and you want to start twist the braid a little bit and then twist the braid around the braid like a little swirl or cinnabon or you know like what I'm doing here then of course pin it in place so that it will stay do 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 more video silence I just need to find some free background music and put that in instead of these weird silences all right so now the last part is gather the hair and make a braid and I sprayed mine first with hairspray so that it will come out much smoother and prettier I also put in a hairband to help hold it into place since we are working with more hair, hair here. Once it is braided, do the same thing that what you did to the other two braids, you know, the little flower thing. But this one, don't make it tight or, you know, make it loose and pretty, not too loose though. And I was able to move the right side up a little bit more, you know, the right bun thing so that it would all fit better because you don't want them to be touching, the three braids to be touching. You want them to be separated, and this is pretty much the trickiest part, because you may have to redo the whole thing, which I had to do like 10 times, and yeah. All right, so like I said, you know, you want to twist it around and create this flower bun, and then pin it, and what I used to pin is a big one at first, and then a few smaller ones to hold it in place. And that completely works just fine. Alright, and that's the hairstyle and that's how to make young Aunt Bruce hairdo. Thanks for watching guys. Bye. Do or do not. There is no try. Does me by my size, do you? For eight hundred years have I trained Jedi. <laughs>